Tom has a joy that just, he just exudes a joy that you can see on his face and his demeanor. There's just a positivity about him that's just, um, it's infectious. He just, you can tell he loves life. When he started here, he came to me and he said, are you okay with me reading with the children? I, I said, definitely go in there and read. And, and um, he's just done a fabulous job with that. Kids love him. I just come in on my own time and, and I'm not asking him to take anything away from work. I just want to do it on my own time. I don't, you know, it was nothing. I just wanted to do it and it just worked out nice and I enjoy it. I come in at 10 or 10.30 and I read before I go to work at 11 and so it's, uh, it's been really nice and uh, I've enjoyed it. The librarian has picked out new books for me and I read and she, like if she gets a new book. There's one book and it's Moo. That's the only word in the whole book is Moo, but it's just how you say it. And you know, try to, you know, to bring that to the kids to let them know that it always don't have to be pictures or it always don't have to be a bunch of words. But that book was, they loved it last year. <laughs> Tom understands that his job as an, a school employee is more than just come in, clean the building. He understands that he's an integral part of the staff and the goals that we're trying to accomplish because we're setting a foundation at this young age for them to love school and love to read. And he understands that. And so I think that's his, his way of helping us accomplish our goals of helping our students be strong readers is to read to them. Tom is an inspiration to everybody. He's always got a smile on his face and, and um, he really builds those relationships and sometimes, you know, we get busy in the day-to-day -day of our jobs and, and the things that are going on that, you know, we forget that everybody, those kids, they're looking up to us and really when it comes down to the end of the day, they're going to remember the things that we did and, and the things that we taught them and the love that we gave them here at St. B. It's something I'll never be able to explain to probably anybody what it does for me. 23 years in the Army, you get out and you kind of get depressed. There's a lot of things going on in your head and your life. And this is one thing that just makes me happy. Picking up a book and reading and learning and just, I, th I think uh, a lot of kids might not understand what you can get out of a book or, you know, just the enjoyment and to show them that I enjoy reading a, a little kid's book and then they get excited about it and see the excitement about reading. I mean, that's that's our future. And, and I've seen it with my grandson, so I just wanted to share it because I think he is more prepared for school, kindergarten stuff, just because my daughter and us, we always read to him. And so I see these kids and I just enjoy reading. I mean, people ask me all the time, what do you enjoy doing a custodian job? It's more than just a custodian job. I mean, the kids, I could see them every day, the smiles and just being happy and just so young and just innocent, you know, it's nice and it makes me happy.